What is a maths historian? You, you are a maths historian, Dr. Bridget Stenhouse. <laughs> I don't know. I became a maths historian by doing my undergrad degree in maths. And I'd always loved history in school, but I kind of felt this pressure. Like I knew I wanted to do a maths degree. So for my A-levels, I just took like maths, physics, chemistry, because that's what you do. Like you're a scientist or you're a humanities scholar. And I chose to be like a mathematician. And so then when I got to university and I was like, wait, I can do both? This is great! And then for my master's thesis, I knew I wanted to do a history of maths dissertation and I knew I wanted to write about a woman. And Mary Somerville has the great benefit of all her letters are in English, which is a language that I read. And also her collection of letters is held in Oxford, which is where I was at the time. So it meant that I could use her archives which was incredible. And so now I have a PhD in history of maths, uh, which is great. I mean, history of maths is amazing. You get to do mathematics, you get to do languages, you get to do history, a bit of sociology, a bit of philosophy. Um, it's just like a really vibrant field, which sort of brings all these things together, um, which I think is why I love it so much. I could read 19th century letters for the rest of my life and be incredibly happy. You just really get to know a person through reading these letters. So now I teach university level mathematics, but my research is looking at 19th century maths. So kind of what it means to be a mathematician, how mathematical knowledge moves around, looking at that society can then reflect upon, okay, what does it mean to be a mathematician today? And maybe who has more access than somebody else and how we can go about fixing that, which is also something I'm quite passionate about. Math historians of the future, what will they be looking back at? Honestly, dread to take, because I mean, <laughs> I communicate a lot via WhatsApp and Messenger, like with yeah. colleagues. So I'm just like, how are they ever going to access that? And also is subsumed by other conversations. The letters give you so much about, about people, but it's probably because it's their WhatsApp conversations. Yeah, 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 that's true. Yeah, I hope they'll look back and see success and efforts to get a wider range of people into <laughs> mathematics. Yeah, in case this cuts off, because it will. Thank you, thank you, thank you.